Hey, hello everybody. Welcome back to Saying It Like It Is. Today, once again, I'd like to thank everybody from my previous video. Uh, we got a, I, got, I got a few responses. And in the responses in the comments that I got, I noticed that a lot of drivers are seeing similar issues when they work in on these gig X. So we have some evidence. And we also have evidence from other gig economy content creators on YouTube where they post videos about similar situations. And we see that comments and responses are pretty much, they are dealing with the problems as the topic of the video was, was being addressed about that issue. But today, once again, I want to ask everybody that's watching right now, all the viewers, I know most of you are going to be drivers, delivery drivers, working in the gig economy. And I think it's, this is more crucial for a better effectiveness of these apps. We know they have tried to do some changes, but it, it looks like there's some very old issues that are still there. They are still present even today. And what I ask for the viewers is, do you think that they should make these crucial updates when it comes to the delivery service being more quicker or more prompt to their customers? Now, we know that a lot of these gig economy channels, they talk about a few things. And we know that a lot of these gig economy companies, they have websites. And when it comes to the driver side of things, they'll tell you, you know, how to do these deliveries so they can be done in a better, quicker, and prompt manner. How to make these deliveries even faster. And they give you suggestions. And they show you when to arrive at the restaurant. And they tell you how to quickly get to the customer's house. And they give you some ideas of how to expedite the delivery, to make it even go even, even faster. But we don't see that with the, on the customer's end. And that's what this video is about. Do you think that all of these gig economy companies should have more notifications on the ordering form on the sites where people are ordering to notify them of things that that can also help expedite the process of the delivery service. Make it run more efficiently, more better with less headaches and the deliveries can be done even quicker. Like an example, a notification when, I'm not picking on one gig economy company, this applies to all the gig economy companies when, when customers are ordering, on the ordering form. A notification, for example, that says that if you live in a condominium and you have a gate, uh, please provide the gate code, the building number and the apartment number, for these deliveries can be done quicker and, and a driver can get to, the, to, your, to your destination even faster. Because we understand it's a simple thing to, to think about. It's something that is common sense. But we have to give the benefit of the doubt that some of these customers, they have a lot, a lot of things going on in their minds, let's say, right? They might be very busy. They might be thinking about a lot of things. And some things that are simple, they might forget to do. Like providing a gate code or providing a, an apartment number in the condominium complex, which a lot of us have gone through that. It's just a notification, an update on the app, or an update on their website to notify customers about this. Do you guys think that that will help the delivery process go even smoother? This way, if a customer forgets, they can read the notification, 
I know some of you might say, well, this is such an obvious thing for a customer to figure out on their own. Why should they have a notification? Like I said, even though it's a simple thing to think about, it's just at the time when they order it, they're, 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 they'd be thinking they're busy. They're, uh, let's say they're, uh, they're going through something. Uh, they're thinking of a lot of things. They're busy in their mind. And that simple thing did not cross their mind. It happens, it can happen to anybody. But what do I believe? I believe, and I believe that most of drivers out there and other people who are not drivers, I think this is something that it's crucial for any gig economy app to have these notifications in the ordering form for the customers so they can see. And this applies also to other orders that have shop and deliver. For instance, let's say customer ordered some things and one of those things is alcohol. I think it's crucial to have a notification in the order when the customer is ordering that says that uh, your, if your order contains alcohol, please be ready with an identification when a delivery driver arrives at your, at your destination or arrives at your home or delivers your groceries. Please be ready to have identification ready. Alcohol orders require ID, identification. Now, you might say, some people might say, well, that's obvious too that these people should know that with alcohol that you need ID. But it, it still applies that they, they still can, can be busy. They can be thinking about other things and they'll be forgetting about that I have to show ID for this order. They might have other things going on in their mind. You have to give them the benefit of the doubt to the customer. But at least, how can these companies help improve the, the speed and, exp, and, and expedite these orders even quicker? And I believe that's crucial to, to put notifications on the order forms. This way, if they happen to be, they get a lot of things going on in their mind and they're busy and they're not thinking about these things, they can read it on the form, on the ordering form, they can see a notification, and that will make them remember, oh yeah, look, I, I need to show ID, I forgot about that. Oh look, I need to provide my gate code, which if, if, even though it's a simple thing, they'll read it. Please provide gate code and building an apartment number if you're living in a condominium complex or apartment complex. Stuff like that. They might read it, and that might pop up in their mind and say, oh yeah, I forgot I forgot that before I order, I forgot that I was going to put that there, the gate code and the building number and all that. You see what I'm saying? Because we know we get a lot of orders when it comes to condominium complexes. You don't see the gate code, and sometimes you don't even see the building number or the apartment number. Sometimes they just put an address of the whole area and you're over there wasting time and if the customer doesn't answer the phone and then you message them and they don't answer the messages, you got to call the company. Now the company has to deal with it. They have to try and call the customer. Sometimes the orders get canceled and it creates a mess. How crucial it is to have notifications when customers are ordering on the order, ordering form or on the ordering section where they're at to have notifications of things like that. Same thing with alcohol. How many times you have a delivery of alcohol, you get to the door and then they show up at the door with no ID. And then you have to ask them that, by the way, this order requires identification. And then they say, oh yeah, yeah, you're right. You know what I'm saying? And some of them, Some of them will be ordering stuff that has alcohol in it that they require to be present at the delivery time when it arrives, and they're not there because they forget. They ran an errand, they made an order, and they made and, and they after that they went ahead to, to do an errand, 
thinking that the delivery is going to take 45 minutes. Now, who knows where they went, right? So the time the delivery driver shows up and there's alcohol in the order and you try to call them and text them and saying that you need ID and they'll tell you, oh, just leave it there at the door and you, you got to tell them that we cannot do that. The order requires identification. There's alcohol in the order. They have to be present with somebody to show ID for the order. And they tell you, oh, I'm not home right now. I should be there in a half an hour or I should be there in 45 minutes. And that's if you can get a hold of them through calling the customer or messaging the customer. If they don't respond and you call the company, they'll tell you to bring the stuff back. How crucial it is, and that's the purpose of the video, that how crucial it is that these companies need to do these updates specifically for the customers. I believe they are crucial for these del deliveries can, can be done a lot smoother and a lot quicker and less headaches. Are you guys? Let me know in the comments and I'll catch you guys later.